welcome back to the show. I'm your presenter, Mr. Man. Many of you know me as Vincent, obviously, because you came from my Speed Compare channel where I do car reviews, but today we're not doing car reviews. We're going to speak about something very important. Something that has been pressing the scientific community since about 25 minutes or so. Anyway, do buildings and objects on Earth actually make the Earth heavier. And I'm going to give you a scientific explanation for it, okay? So don't go away. But first it is time for our new segment, the Improv Imbecile. This is the segment where you leave me questions that I answer in an improv fashion. Since this is the first time and I was neglecting asking you questions the last time, I'm just going to pick something at random. What is an important moment in Mexican history. This is a good question, eh? Yesterday, my cousin was cutting the lawn for his American overlords, those pigs. I spit on him. And they told him, Juan, what are you doing? Do you know what he told him? He said, I, I don't speak, I play. And then they call the police and he go to jail. But a uh, good question, uh, uh, important moment in uh, Mexican history is uh, the time where Napoleon come to okay, Spain. Uh, lots of people, Mexico, eh? and I take my grandfather and I say, Puto, you know what I'm saying? Sorry, I clean this up, don't worry. Eh? Wait, I clean it up later. Anyway, important moment, uh, Jess, is this. Uh, don't, don't ask me any more questions. Uh, uh, just one day I go to the toilet and uh, I see Mexican, Spanish, come in Sp uh, Mexico. Uh, so I tell him, you know, I say. And uh, they are ripped away. They go away. Because they listen, eh? Because in Mexico we don't play. We don't play. That was pretty stupid, but it's the first segment, so here we go. That was that. I hope you enjoyed. Ask me questions down below, and it'll be featured in the next Improv Imbecile. Is that what I called it? I think so. But back to our original topic. Is the Earth getting heavier every day? Babies are born. Babies are mass. Mass that wasn't there before. Mass that came from a single sperm, an egg, uh, and what happens is the stalk brings the babies from Jesus. And so what happens is that the earth just gets heavier and heavier and heavier and we build things and you know we, we take light material and mix them up with, with other light material to make heavy material and so obviously the earth is getting heavier. No! You might say, but all these materials are already on earth. That's true, they are here. Bricks are here, I mean the materials to make bricks are here, but the materials that we use to make a brick weigh less than an entire brick because there's heat involved, there's expansion involved, all that kind of stuff. So we're actually making the things heavier. Trust me, I have extensive knowledge because I googled it. It took me about three minutes. But what I'm saying is the earth can't get heavier because the earth is weightless in space. If you have one really long pole from planet to planet and you push the pole apart, the plants will just go effortlessly. You could get a dog to do it. There's a dog right there. There's a Ruby! Ruby! Hey girl! This is Ruby and she's grumpy because I woke her up from her nap, aren't you? Yeah, give me a kiss. Oh, she's pulling her head away. I see how it is. If Ruby were to extend the pole from planet to planet, it would move because there is no gravity in space. Unless, well that's not true either. It's just kind of, just, just trust me, okay? Don't question my methods. Thank you, Ruby. Do you want to say anything to anybody? Like give a shout out or? I will end you. No? No shout outs? I guess not. And so, ergo, the Earth isn't getting heavier, even though it is. And I hope that clarifies it for you stoned people who've actually thought about that before. I really hope you enjoyed the show, guys. Remember to subscribe if you're not, and uh, leave a like and comment, and comment what should be my next 
improv imbecile topic and I might just pick yours. Bye!